And thank you so much. Well, in uh, police news here tonight, Tulsa police arrested a guy accused of taking inappropriate pictures of more than 80 women since August 2021. Investigators say Daniel Toy took pictures in dressing rooms and even set up a camera inside a bathroom inside his home. News on 6 is Mackenzie Gladney joins us now live with those disturbing details tonight. Mackenzie. Brian, the police say the way this started, they say he was taking pictures of a woman inside a dressing room. That led to a search of a cell, which led to hundreds of more pictures. Someone that's brazen enough to walk into public and just follow them and photograph them and stick cell phones under fitting room doors in public, the only way to describe that behavior is predatory. The investigation started all because a woman was brave enough to not only confront him but speak out when she saw Daniel Toy taking pictures of her. As she opened the door and confronted the subject who ran into a nearby, uh, a different uh, changing room stall and she was yelling at him to, hey, let me see the pictures and he told her no and she started yelling for help. That led to a search warrant at his house, which led to a shocking discovery. We found videos that show Toy installing a hidden camera in his residential bathroom, recorded several women in that bathroom in his residence. In Toy's phone, they also also found pictures of 44 women who haven't been identified yet changing in dressing rooms around town, plus 40 more women just walking around area stores and malls. Uh, we found series of photographs on there that show Daniel uh, Toy was going through um, retail establishments and just walking around following and photographing women. Unfortunately, detectives say women need to look out for cameras when they're in bathrooms or changing rooms. You're shopping and you continually see the same person, you know, behind you or close to to you, that should probably raise it maybe some red flags. If you're in a fitting room and it's not really busy, but someone steps in a stall next to you, you know, that should obviously raise some red flags as well. Now, police say they were able to identify two of the women inside that bathroom. Both of those women say they had no idea they were being videotaped. Live in Tulsa, Mackenzie Gladney, Oklahoma Zone, News 1-6.